Welcome to our channel, today we are going to be discussing a question that many people have wondered about, why don't planes stop in the air and let the earth rotate under them until they reach the desired place? First of all, it is important to understand that planes fly at incredibly high speeds. A typical commercial jet travels at an average speed of around 550 to 600 miles per hour. If a plane were to stop in the air and wait for the earth to rotate, it would take a significant amount of time for the desired location to come into view. Additionally, planes are not designed to hover in the air. They are built to fly at high speeds and maintain a steady trajectory. Stopping in the air would put a tremendous amount of stress on the aircraft, and it is unlikely that the plane could withstand the pressure for an extended period of time. Another reason is that stopping in the air would be highly inefficient from a fuel perspective. Planes are designed to fly in a straight line, and stopping in the air would require the use of additional fuel to maintain altitude. This would significantly increase the cost of the flight and make it prohibitively expensive for most passengers. Lastly, the Earth's rotation is not consistent and it varies depending on the location. The rotation of the Earth is fastest at the equator and slowest at the poles. Therefore, it would be difficult to accurately predict the rotation of the Earth and plan a flight accordingly. In addition to the above reasons, there are other factors that would make stopping in the air impossible. One of the major factors to consider is safety. In order for a plane to stop in the air, it would need to be at a high altitude to avoid any potential collisions with other planes or obstacles. This would require the plane to be equipped with specialized equipment, such as oxygen tanks for passengers, and additional systems to handle the high altitude environment. This would not only be costly, but it would also present a significant safety risk for passengers. We also need to consider the weather conditions. Stopping in the air would make the plane vulnerable to weather changes and storms. If a plane were to stop in the air during a thunderstorm, it would be at a high risk of getting struck by lightning. It would also be difficult to predict the weather conditions and plan a flight accordingly. Another important factor to consider is the impact on air traffic control systems. Air traffic control systems are designed to manage the flow of aircraft in the airspace, and stopping in the air would create a significant disruption to the existing system. This would not only be costly, but it would also create safety hazards. Furthermore, we need to consider the impact on passengers. Stopping in the air would mean that passengers would be stuck on the plane for an extended period of time. This would be uncomfortable and would also present a significant safety risk if an emergency were to occur. Moreover, it's important to note that the concept of stopping in the air is not the only way to reduce the travel time. Airlines and aircraft manufacturers are continuously developing new technologies to make air travel more efficient and faster. For example, the development of supersonic jets which can fly faster than the speed of sound, or the new hypersonic jets that can travel at more than five times the speed of sound, are some of the recent advancements in the aviation industry. In summary, while the idea of stopping in the air and letting the earth rotate beneath the plane might sound interesting, it is not a practical or feasible solution for air travel. The high speeds at which planes travel, the stress on the aircraft, the cost, fuel consumption, safety risks, weather conditions, air traffic control systems, and passenger comfort, as well as the impact on the environment make it impossible to implement. However, the aviation industry is constantly evolving and new technologies are being developed all the time, to make air travel more efficient and faster. It's important to remember that the goal of the industry is to provide safe, comfortable and efficient travel experience for passengers. It's also important to note that air travel has many benefits such as connecting people and cultures, fostering trade and commerce, and boosting economies around the world. We should continue to support and advance the aviation industry while ensuring that it operates in a sustainable and responsible manner. While the idea of stopping in the air and letting the earth rotate beneath the plane may seem like a fun concept, it is not practical or feasible for air travel. The aviation industry is constantly evolving and new technologies are being developed all the time to make air travel more efficient and faster. Another aspect to consider is the impact on the environment. Air travel is a significant contributor to climate change, due to the emissions produced by aircraft engines. Stopping in the air would significantly increase the amount of fuel consumed and, as a result, the amount of emissions produced. This would have a negative impact on the environment and would not be sustainable in the long term. In addition, it's important to note that air travel has many benefits such as connecting people and cultures, fostering trade and commerce, and boosting economies around the world. The aviation industry plays a vital role in the global economy, and it's important to support and advance it while ensuring that it operates in a sustainable and responsible manner. 
In recent years, the aviation industry has been taking steps to reduce its environmental impact. For example, many airlines are investing in more fuel-efficient aircraft and alternative fuels. Additionally, the industry is working to improve air traffic management systems, which will reduce emissions and improve efficiency. Moreover, new technologies such as electric aircraft, hybrid electric propulsion systems, and hydrogen fuel cells are being developed which have the potential to significantly reduce the environmental impact of air travel. These new technologies are in the early stages of development, but they represent a promising future for the aviation industry. In conclusion, while the idea of stopping in the air and letting the earth rotate beneath the plane may seem like a fun concept, it is not practical or feasible for air travel. The high speeds at which planes travel, the stress on the aircraft, the cost, fuel consumption, safety risks, weather conditions, air traffic control systems, passenger comfort, and the impact on the environment make it impossible to implement. However, the aviation industry is constantly evolving and new technologies are being developed all the time to make air travel more efficient, faster and sustainable. We hope this video has helped to provide a comprehensive understanding of why this concept is not possible and the efforts made by the industry to reduce its impact on the environment.